How's it going guys? Hope you all are doing great. This is Evlog coming to you live and welcome back on another episode on Blue Lock. Now, towards the ending of the previous episode, not only were we hit with a cliffhanger, but the situation can't be as desperate as it is right now because Kuyan has traded, has jumped ship, has betrayed his own brethren. And now Team Z is in a destitute situation, uncertain if they will be able to hack this one, if they will be able to come out of this one. Without further ado, let's check out the next episode on Blue Lock, episode 7, and see what took place. <laughs> I get to say, I did not expect Kuyan to do what he did. I did not expect him to do what he did in any way, shape, or form. But he did it, he did it anyway. Team Z are losing. And, um... I believe this is Chijiri saying this. We haven't seen his ability just yet. I believe this is a time for Chijiri to show us what he's really made out of. I believe if there's ever a time Chijiri is going to demonstrate to us what he can really, really do. I believe that this, the moment has arrived, the moment has called itself for him to show us what. He can really do. Because if he allows his team to lose, if he allows this to happen, if they get defeated, they are done for. They are done for. So, something got to give. Something got to give. Between two things, one must happen. They just can't lose at this point. Something got to give. And there's a lot of promise on Chijiri too. Even if, if you pay attention, right? If you guys have been paying attention to the opening, you can see Chijiri's ability. He does have ability, but we don't really know what is, is it really, really all about. I feel like it could be close to um, Hisagi's ability, but more flawless, more uh, 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 um, beautiful. Good job, Timzy. <laughs> Kuyon. Kuyon. Kuros, Kuros, Kuros. Hmm. 12 on 10. Look at his face. And that's another thing. Is Isagi is going to have to do something different. They're going to have to play a different game because all the Oh, they are. Oh, here he comes again. Kuyon has given the other team all their play cards. All their play cards has been um, given to the enemy. Oh, man. Here's another. Oi! Nani! <laughs> he stopped it. Oh boy, he stopped it. Mm, so if they get a goal in, it will be a draw. Come on, Chijiri man. 
Come on, Chujuri. Are you telling me you, you're just going to sit there and mope all day? No, oh, this Wanama brothers has been on Chujuri's back from day one. And it looks like he even go beyond, he even goes further back when before Blue Lock. Yoma Chujiri. He's, he's fast. So, speed is his weapon. He's fast. That's his thing. And for some particular reason, I'm starting to feel like his injury was caused by these Wanima brothers. I feel like they caused his injury because he was outshining them, right? He was outperforming them and they got jealous and did him in. Mm, here comes the ladies cheering for him. Mm. He was good at what he he was good at um at his thin. Oh Aya Okay, it wasn't the it wasn't <laughs> one of my brothers that injured him. Mm. And Chujiri being out of um, out of the play, him being out out of action allowed the Wanama or Wanima brothers to triumph. It helped them to move forward. He got a bracelet. Uh, his speed is not his speed is no longer as he used to be. Time is going. Time is going. Time is not on their side anymore. The countdown pushes on.
Madame, Madada, Chijiri san. So ever since then, he has been mentally sick, mentally discouraged to bet on himself ever again. And this one in my brothers know how to play mind games. They know how to play mind games. At least he worked on Chijiri and scarred him ever since then. Additional time. Wow. Three minutes left. Ooh, he dribbled. He dribbled. He dribbled out of him. Whoo! Here comes. Here he comes. Ooh. Oh, interception. Oh boy, they are so desperate now. They are so desperate and the ball is about to pass or it's about to move away from Chijiri once again. Isagi is not giving up till the end. Chijiri is just standing there. Mm, he caught it. Get out of my way. Because <laughs> I cannot screw you. Uh, Chijiri is not giving up. I mean, Isagi is not giving up, man. If this match ends and Chijiri doesn't do it, then if he doesn't do a goddamn thing about this situation, I'm going to be very very disappointed at him another interception is Isagi is very very lucky there that um that slide didn't hit a viral area He slayed. It's about time. It's about time. Get your punk ass up, man. Psycho da. Sweet. Here he comes. He has decided to get out of his mental shackle that he's been in for years. Ooh, and he's all alone. I see you. EK, come on. Sweet. Here he comes. That speed of his. 
Here he goes. Here he goes. Sui! <laughs> All right. It, oh, wow. He's really fast. He's really fast. Screw you. <laughs> I will say, screw, screw Kuyon. Screw him for betraying his team. I can no wait to see his face once this team loses or once Team Z wins against their opponent. Mm-hmm. Wow, he is fast. He passed, the, he chipped it away and he's chasing after it. Oh, he jumped. Wow, like one of them, one of my brothers wanted to injure him right there. He wanted to literally maim him. Hmm. Acceleration. Damn. Sui! He jumps. Moto, 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 moto. Mm, he chipped. Ooh! Wow! Sugoi. Sugoi. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Oh my goodness. I've never seen Chijiru this happy. I'm actually trying to to compose myself not to go wild right now, not to go not to wild out right now. This is beautiful. Wow. And for the fact that he haven't used it in a long time, that means that that area of his muscle is as fresh as anything. So Chijiri is back finally after all this time, after everything he took. It took them to almost about to lose this matchup for him to really get out of his mental mind shackle that he put on himself. So now Chijiri believes in himself once again. <laughs> it's good to see, man. They're going to need speed, definitely. Speed is always a key thing in his sports. They're whooping his ass over there. They're stomping the mud on him. <laughs> He's running. Wow, 5-2. Next match is the final one out of their group. Team V is their final match.
Who is he talking to? Oh, he's trying to go and convince the Team V. He's trying to convince them to work with them. Five goals, top score, score five goals. This one scored six goals. This one so scores seven goals overall. <laughs> oh, Team Z is about to face a big challenge. Those three guys are top scorers. Six, seven, five. So this is what Kuyan has brought himself down to. Hmm. Like I said, who are you? <laughs> Sorry. Don't weigh it out. Don't weigh it out. It is Team Z indeed. Oh boy. My oh my. Sate, sate, sate. Now, guys, what an excellent episode. From the beginning to the end, I love the way Team Z introduced themselves. They came in and they introduced themselves, letting Team V know. You don't disrespect soccer. You don't disrespect football. You don't talk bad. You don't talk trash. You don't bitch and moan. You don't underestimate the pride of football. And for you to have it at the back of your mind, that is you against us next. And based on everything that we've been, that we've been through thus far, we are now looking at losing this matchup. We would rather die than to lose this match that is exactly what team z came to tell team v and i hope that team v takes it seriously well of course they're gonna get serious i mean for the fact that team z had to get out of their comfort zone to come into the um cafeteria area to introduce themselves to them here is a show no that um it's going to be uh, an interesting matchup on the next episode. But uh, before we get to that next matchup next week, I am elated to see that Tijiri has um, overcame the mental chains that he has put himself into. And that mental chain, mental lockdown he put on himself has done more damage actually to him mentally but now he has freed himself from it i got to say that uh it's beautiful to see now he can uh now he can go all the way and he can be able to overcome his limits there you have it folks Episode 7 on Blue Lock. What an amazing episode. On that note, stay safe. Keep on keeping on. <laughs> Sweet.